All right. This is what we're going to be taking a look at today. The Pick Portable Mosquito Zapper. I think I picked this up at Walmart about a month ago. I ain't opened it. Um, I do this outside, but the mosquitoes are <laughs> too bad. So, uh, there you go. All what it does. I don't know. I was just lo looking for for some uh, something to deal with the mosquitoes. And this is what I came up. This is what I found. I, well, I, I did the fogger thing. You know, the can of fogger. And that worked for one afternoon. I should really go get my tripod. To... Oh, there it is. Oh. No. Hope I had it the right way. Okay, so. Yep, that's all in there. Apparently, I'm not real sure when I bought it what it was. Apparently, this is like a miniature zapper. And it comes with some kind of Oh, look, a little, I guess a little brush to clean out the dead mosquitoes. Let's hope I have to use that. Okay. Oh, okay. It comes with a USB cord. Instructions. Who needs instructions? And I'm guessing this is going to be the lure to lure... mosquitoes into the zapper which I think is a just an awesome idea mm. two in one charge and go zapper with accent light well now someplace here we have to charge this thing ah right there okay so I'm gonna go hook this up to the 12 volt let it be charging and then I'll bring you back whenever it's charged and I apparently this little thing doodad there is I would think a hanger to hang it from uh, hang it. Uh, yeah You'd probably hang it like that I think that's also where the lure goes I looked at one of the photos on the box and it just showed them putting it in so let me get this charged up These three position switch. Oh, it's already got a charge on it. I guess that's the accent light. Oh. Oh, that's the UV light. I guess that's all three right there. Oh, that's pretty cool. What? It's like a little flying saucer type thing. I'm still going to put this on the charger because I'm betting that battery's low. Supposedly a 30 day works for 30 days we're here, this we'll see let me fully charge it get it outside and hopefully have to use a little brush to wipe out all the dead mosquitoes okay so i've charged this and you put your micro usb in there um when it's charging, there's a little red light right there. And when it's fully charged, it went goes to green. And mine was green. So now I'm going to put... I'm going to actually turn it. I got mosquitoes. Uh, three levels. I guess that's the regular. And the second one, if I can get it there. Well, that's full. Three. Okay. It's supposed to be UV. Now where I got my... And, oops. That's just the accent lot. So, this thing comes with a bunch of do's and don'ts, <laughs> or mostly don'ts, like don't get it wet, or don't spray water into it, don't touch that screen. So, I'm going to put the bait in there now. Or I can get it open. Well, apparently, they don't want you to get into it. But little do they know, I have a pair of scissors right here by my chair.
and it says this is this baits good for 30 days i don't know how long that charge is so and you you can smell it already well there's already mosquitoes out here after me so it's cleared off it, definitely there's one right there on my arm let me show you how the old-fashioned way is, is to get rid of mosquitoes yeah see there i don't know if you've seen that or not but he's dead uh, so this little thing and i'm gonna hang this actually i'm gonna set it right here by me okay got the bait in uh, i don't know why it's so hard to get there yeah see the uv lights there so i'm just gonna put that there i guess that's how it works i'm guessing now i'll let you know in 30 days or before how that works so right now we got it on uv and there's mosquitoes around so they should be going to there but maybe they like this 250 pound bait sitting here better than that <laughs> i don't know let's see if i can get you there we go okay there you go and let's just see if any mosquitoes come here next minute or so because they're out i just killed that one sorry let me get the there we go tripod set up there okay well i have my thermosel on let me turn my thermosel off that's supposed to be a... can, can you see it yeah you're seeing it i don't know how long that charge lasts i don't know if you have you know we'll figure it i didn't see it any place on the I guess I imagine it depends on how much you use the whether you use accent light the ultraviolet light or both of them together and I guess to clean it you stick the little brush in there and clean it out without the power on they made that clear several times in the instructions Basically, from what I understand, this is a miniature bug zapper with that bait chamber on the inside. I'd prefer a big bug zapper, but then I would have to have 110 power, so. And of course, now that I have it on, there's no mosquitoes going to come. Oh, there's one. Oh, see, he's after me, not that stuff over there. Okay, no mosquito came for me instead of that, so maybe I shouldn't be out here because they obviously prefer me over that bait that's in there. Okay, maybe I'll bring you back tonight when you can see the ultraviolet. Oh, there's a mosquito after me. That's been three for me, zero for the bug zapper. Come on, y'all. I'm supposed to be attracted to this, not me. I'm the bug slapper, not the bug zapper. Okay, guys been about a week since I've been gone uh, 
the lights actually died yesterday so it's well i say it's been a week since i put this out i was gone for like four days and so as you can see there's not very many bugs there really i can't tell there's any more than when i left and I just turned this off yesterday, uh, last night, because yesterday the lights were working and now they're out. So I guess it lasts about a week. Yeah, see they're off. So I'm going to charge this up again. But this upcoming week, I'm going to see how long it lasts with just the light on. Not, not the UV light, the regular white light. And see if I get any more bugs. I'll take that little brush if I can find it. Brush all the de few dead ones that are in there out. I don't know if you can see those or not. There ain't hardly any in there. And it sure doesn't seem to do anything to the mosquitoes. But I'm going to give it another week on. Or how long it will last on a full charge with just the white light on. Or maybe the white light and the ultra light. I don't know what the ultraviolet light is supposed to do. From what I can tell, they don't do nothing. But hey, let's give it another try. I really would like for this thing to work. Okay, so I've had this on the charger all day. It's charged. Green light. Right there. Right here. Was on. Uh, so tonight, I, I thought about leaving it on... The ultraviolet and the like that, the white, but I cannot tell the ultraviolet did anything. So I'm gonna get off here. I'm gonna clean all these bugs off. Then I'm just gonna leave it on regular light tonight and see what happens until it goes down again. Cause I know just the ultraviolet by itself didn't do anything. Um, still has a bait in it. I can't tell that it does anything when I'm out here. I'm a bigger, uh, bait than that stuff there you see there so let me see what just the light by itself will do okay light is uh, uh, zapper is all cleaned you can see I actually found it just easier to blow it <laughs> blow on it and blow the dead ones off because there wasn't many so there we go I'm just going to set it there that's what we're going to do until it runs down. I don't know if it'll run down tonight. Oh, there's still one one in there. Can you see him? Okay, he's gone. So anyway, we're just gonna leave it on regular light tonight and see what that does. Well, it, it might make a good Christmas ornament. It might be useful for that. Turn the lights on. Because this sure as heck isn't a good bud zapper. I, okay. Over two weeks now. This last time I cleaned it and used the white light. You see any dead bugs in there? Zero. And it's been out four nights on white light only. I actually got a little bit more bugs when it was on ultraviolet, but, but right above here is my um, security light that stays dim until motion and it goes bright and there's always bugs at night. So it's just, it hung right up there and then my security lights are right up here. So even those bugs should have been attracted to it. Zilch. This is 17, 18, 20 bucks with tax or something at Walmart. Luckily I kept the receipt and the box and this is going to go back to walmart i'm getting my money back i'm not giving it a full month i thought at least it would kill a few zero on white light only i think there was one there but it was one i couldn't get off before so pretty disappointed of course i knew it was you know too good to be true have a little zapper there that zaps the mosquitoes i'm gonna cut the cord off but you know I thought I'd give it a try. Just didn't work out. Um, the so-called bait inside of it didn't really track nothing that I can tell. So not worth, certainly not worth 20 bucks. I don't know if you can see it better now. Yeah, there's nothing in there. 
I was so tempted to stick my finger in her and see if it zapped me, but you know, 20, 30, 20, 30 years ago, I would have done that. <laughs> Not now. So, anyway, this pick thing, pick bu mini bug zapper thing, don't waste your money on it. At least that's my opinion after trying it for two weeks. Not worth it. If you do, keep the box, keep the receipt, because you might want to take it back like I am. Okay, Donald. One acre homesteader. I'm out of here.